My name is Uju Kim. I joined the United Nations African Institute for Economic Development and Planning, UNIDEP, in Dakar as SDGs and Volunteer Knowledge Management Specialist. I've been working on sustainable development, uh, including climate change and empowerment of women and youth in the past 10 years at different UN agencies and organizations across countries and continents, um, being responsible for program coordination, uh, communication, and knowledge management. My assignment at IDEP is to make emphasis on volunteerism and promote volunteer-based solution in achieving sustainable development goals. In 2015, the United Nations officially recognized that volunteerism can be a powerful and cross-cutting means of implementation of the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development uh, that it can help to expand and mobilize the constituencies and uh, engage people in national planning and implementation of the 2030 Agenda, and that the volunteer groups can help to localize the Agenda by providing new areas of interaction between government and people for concrete and scalable actions. The United Nations uh, General Assembly um, encourages governments to integrate volunteerism uh, into um, national development uh, strategies, plans and policies uh, in partnership with United Nations entities, uh, volunteer involving organizations, the private sector, civil society, including academia uh, and other stakeholders. Against this background, the United Nations uh, member states and stakeholders have agreed on the plan of action to integrate volunteerism into uh, peace and development um, policies and programs for the next decade and beyond. My support for this initiative uh, involves a collaboration among three different UN entities. One, the United Nations Volunteers Program. Two, the United Nations Economic Commission for Africa, UNECA, and three, UNIDEP. The UN Volunteers Program, together with uh, International Federation of Red Cross and Red Crescent Societies, uh, as mandated to coordinate the implementation of this plan of action. The UNECA as, as mandated to promote um, the economic and social development of its member states and to support uh, the effectiveness in implementation of the sustainable development goals for the African countries and the UNIDEP as a subsidiary body of the ECA with its primary purpose of supporting African countries to build human resource capacities through uh, training programs, policy advice, and dialogue initiatives. The United Nations General Assembly uh, invited member states to mobilize and support a uh, research community globally to carry out more studies on volunteerism um, and collect data disaggregated by uh, gender, age, and disability in order to provide sound knowledge as a foundation for the relevant policies and programs. To support this, the United Nations Volunteers Program has been mandated to coordinate consolidation and dissemination of the good practices and lessons learned. My specific contribution is uh, gathering, organizing, and sharing information on volunteerism, as well as uh, substantive technical input, such as development of training, uh, training courses on volunteerism, um, which will help public and private stakeholders uh, better understand the importance of volunteerism so that uh, the member states and stakeholders become uh, equipped with volunteer-based solutions uh, in achieving sustainable development goals.
According to United Nations Volunteers Program, there are 109 million uh, full-time equivalent um, volunteers in the world and more studies are currently being undertaken to appreciate the real value of uh, volunteer contributions to the implementation of the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development and it is my distinct pleasure to be part of this global effort. Please visit umv.org to see how UN volunteers all over the world are contributing to achieving sustainable development goals. Please visit the website as well as social media of the UNIDEP to see how we are supporting the economic prosperity and social advancement in sustainable manner in African countries.